Alright, so today's workout is going to be uh, requiring two things, and that is a water bottle and a PVC pipe slash uh, broomstick. Um, this is uh, something that I built, so don't worry about it. But uh, let's go ahead and get started with the warm up, and that's going to be four rounds. Uh, 10 PVC pipe pass throughs, 10 uh, overhead squats, um, 10 windmill slash cherry pickers, and then around the world. Warm up. So you're gonna grab pretty wide on your uh, broomstick handle or PVC pipe, and you're just gonna keep those shoulder blades pinched together and bring it to the front and to the back. And it is a two count movement, meaning that you count the front and the back. So I am on number four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, and ten. Ten. All right, time for those overhead squats. So go ahead and get that PVC pipe. Sit in. Cherries, pickers slash windmills, feet about shoulder width apart, PVC pipe bottom of that scapula, and then you're gonna try reach left to right. That's 10 of them. Now we are going to do around the world. So again, have wide grip on your uh, piece of pipe and you are going to go up on one side, around the back, and then down the other side. That is four rounds of that, 10 reps each movement. So today's workout is gonna involve one piece of equipment and one piece of equipment only, and that is a water jug. A gallon of water weighs 8.34 pounds, and so um, three gallons weighs roughly about 24 pounds, and then the five gallon weighs about 40. Um, so what makes water a little bit more difficult is uh, it's a dynamic load, so it's going to cause a lot more neuromuscular involvement. So uh, today's workout is going to be a Turkish get-up, um, single leg 
or a single arm, uh, single leg crossover deadlift. And then we are going to do single arm swings. And then we are going to do um, single arm squat thrusters for five rounds. So my uh, rep scheme is one, two, three, four, five. And notice that I got a lot of unilateral movements. So uh, every time you do that, you have to make sure you're balanced. So really it is two Turkish get ups, four single arm uh, cross body deadlifts, um, six uh, single arm kettlebell swing, water jug swings, and then four uh, bear hug squats. And then we are gonna be doing 10 um, squat thrusters. Cool, now let's go over those movements. The Turkish get up. So you're gonna start from a leg position. And from this laying position, you're gonna figure out which side you want to press with. So if I'm gonna be pressing with my left hand, my left foot is not gonna move from this position right here. So I got my weight, I'm gonna press it up, and then from here I'm gonna come up onto that elbow on the right side. Then from here, I'm going to go up onto that hand and then into a hip bridge. Then I'm going to bring that right leg underneath me into a kneeling position. From here, I stand up and then if I want to get back down, I'm just going to reverse the order. So it is a kneeling position, fall back onto that uh, right hand, stretch out that right leg so you're in that hip bridge position, set the hips down, back to the elbow, and then back down. So with the weight, it's going to look something like this. So I'm going to grab my jug, I'm going to have it rest against my forearm right there, I'm going to press it up, and then I'm going to go up onto that elbow, onto that hand, into that hip bridge, bring that uh, knee under me, stand up, and then I'm going to reverse the order. Back down, hip bridge, elbow, and all the way back down. Cool. The single leg cross body deadlift. So I'm gonna be going across my body and what it's gonna look like is I'm gonna take that left hand over to my right side, reach down to that water jug and then stand straight up. Switch sides and so on and so forth. So with the weight, what it looks like is this. I'm gonna have a nice proud posture, nice tight core, push that floor away from me, bring it up to the standing position, and then back down. So I'm using that left leg as a counterbalance behind me, and then bringing it up. Once you have completed those two, go ahead and balance it off with the other side. And obviously you're gonna notice that one side might be a little bit stronger than the other. Cool? So be sure to use that, uh, Opposite leg as a counterbalance, point the heel, nice tight core. A single arm water jug swing. Just like you would with a kettlebell uh, swing. You're gonna make a nice little triangle and then from here you're gonna reach down with one hand, you're gonna hike it in towards your special spot and then stand straight up. You're gonna notice that the uh, water jug is lightest at the top of the swing, and that is where I want you to switch your hands. So it is gonna be three each side for a total of six. Cool? Cool, the bear hug squat. So uh, I went ahead and went a little bit heavier for this one. So you're gonna get your water bottle, you're gonna hold it nice and tight, squeeze it like you would a bear, and then you're gonna squat. So you're gonna squat a nice full range of motion, and you are going to squeeze those uh, quads, squeeze those legs at the top, and you're gonna be doing four reps with the bear hug squat. The single arm squat thruster. So we are going to be doing five each side. So what you're going to do is you're going to get that uh, water jug into the front rack position. And to do that, you're going to have the jug 
uh, body rest can get your forearm there. Elbow uh, forward, you're gonna squat, and then you're gonna shoot it up overhead. Switch hands. Single arm, the ruster. Now let's combine all those movements into one round. So I'm gonna start with that Turkish getup. So I'm gonna lay down on the ground and I'm gonna do it on the right side first. So I'm gonna grab that water jug, press it up, up onto that elbow, onto that hand, hip bridge, kneel, stand, back down, kneel, hand, hip bridge, elbow, down. Switch sides. Left hand, press. Up on that right elbow. Right hand, hip bridge, kneel. Stand, kneel. Hand, hip bridge, elbow, down. Move into that cross body deadlift. To each side. One, two, switching sides, one, two, moving to that single arm swing, one, two, three, switch, one, two, three, Bear hug squat, or goblet squat. Single arm thruster. That's one round, do five of those. 